All right, so we are about to test out uh, Chuck's infamous unprotected left turn. Uh, a really, really scary <laughs> intersection, I'm telling you, man. It's, by the way, I just uh, was trying to do some test runs and I ran into Chuck himself. And uh, I'm glad I did because he gave me a tour. Uh, he kind of gave me some pointers on how, what he does and what to look out for and things like that. So that was really, really helpful. Also, I wasn't. Uh, I was. I was plotting a route uh, to. I picked a point of uh, point of interest to to make the car go left, but it wouldn't go left from there. So now this is the intersection. So he 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 told me the right point of interest to pick. So this is the intersection where we may go left from here. That's going to be that infamous intersection coming up in just like maybe uh, 50 feet. So without further ado, let's go. All right, so the first stop sign on, on Huntington Avenue uh, Road is cautious, creeping, creeping, and now, okay, good. It comes up over on the, this is the infamous intersection, Chuck's unprotected left turn. And, uh, all right, it's creeping up, man. These cars are coming, they're just hauling ass big time. So it crept up, as you saw, as what Chuck's video shows all the time, that it crept up so it could avoid, uh, it could get uh, visibility past this uh, fence line that you can't see anymore. But it's a fence, which is that you can see right here. This is one kind of part of the fence. Oh, so the left is absolutely clear. So it should go now. Oh, snap. Oh, stop, stop, stop. Oh, man, it committed. It went all the way through. That person would not have been happy. I'm sure <laughs> they must be like what is this idiot doing he was supposed to have stopped so I'm gonna go and try that one more time here we go so round number two from the stop sign the car is gonna make a left turn and uh, from here it stopped perfect no traffic nowhere you can go yep you got it you got it so that straight up coming up is that dreaded, scary uh, Chuck's infamous unprotected left turn. On the left uh, is the fence. The car is going to creep up a little bit. It's going to see what, it, oh, this is unique. So this is, this is a car right next to it. It's creeping up to kind of get better visibility. Good. No one on the left. So all clear for you, girl. Uh, and nice okay this was the best execution so far very very human like for sure so it's coming up on it it goes up pretty quickly i mean this is all good so far all right here we go this is the main test all right so it doesn't have visibility it has the fence it can't see it because i can't see anything so it's creeping up nicely a little bit up so now it's stopping because it sees everything on the left and it sees everything on the right all right so we're going to go and turn on Oh, oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, stop, stop. So now it's committing. Now, is it going to go and go past that car? Uh, you know what? I don't like that it does that. It did that the last time, too, because it's straight up, you know, like if you see the car behind me, that car had to swerve over very quickly. And that's like, I'm pretty sure somebody's going to flip me the finger pretty soon uh, if I keep doing that, you know, or honk and bo or both. <laughs> so uh let's try one more time because i really want to try to replicate the scenario where it has to make a stop in the median it has to pause there it did it when i when when chuck was demonstrating it to me it actually did it the first time it did it so it's just a matter of having that scenario this that scenario get created that's all that i uh, i'm sure if i tried enough times it's going to happen all right, so now it is coming up on the intersection and it's going to make a left turn right here. This is the unprotected left turn. So stops first, nicely creeps up. This is really consistent behavior, very well, well done. So this is going to be the one way I want to see because it should stop in the median and, and it does. Perfect stop. Like look at that car, it stopped right in the dead center. I love it the way it did it. And it should go now. So 
All right, come on, you can speed, you can go now. You can go, and you sh need to speed up. See, that's what Chuck was saying as well, and I agree with him that when it merges into this leftmost lane of the same side traffic, this is your fast lane. So everyone is going to be going quick, pretty quick here, and if you don't speed up, you're going to find yourself very quickly in a situation where the car behind you is going to get frustrated. Um, so a little tweak that we, I'm sure, Chuck has um, uh, through his channel uh, and his, and his uh, feedback loop back to Tesla that they're paying attention. All right, so I'm done for my testing for today. Uh, I'm going to get back home and I'm going to see if I can test out a few more scenarios if not today by tomorrow and post those videos so thank you for tuning in until next time